it's time for Tomba. As soon as I update our stream info. All right. Now just to open it up, as I find it. File. Oh, boom. We don't even have to do the title screen. We can just load into exactly where we were through the power of my definitely real PlayStation game console system that I have hooked up to my monitor. Look at that. The power of PlayStation. Oh yeah, we left off in the wonderful town of the dwarves. Very, very excited dwarves. But we are on a quest to find and defeat evil pigs. Where we're going to find these evil pigs, I can't say with 100% certainty, but for sure it'll be fine. We will most certainly figure it out. Um, I can't remember if I needed to go in this door. Well, there's definitely a way to go over here, as I recall. But we will do just that. And be very annoyed by the spider at the same time. Oh my lord. Get out of here. face the right way very shortly. Or not. It can't rotate that way anymore. Okay. There we go. Power of physics. Should be able to traverse now that we've rescued Dorfs. The door should let us through. I believe. Actually, I don't remember going over here. No, I definitely wasn't over here. I thought there was a dwarf over here. Oh, maybe there was, and he's just not here anymore. So I didn't actually notice the point where I could find new stuff. Either way, we are continuing. Oh, there's the dwarf. But rather than talk to him, I'm gonna ignore him and travel this way. And somehow land on the singular thing that could kill me. Mushroom forest. I do have a knack for landing exactly where I shouldn't be landing. Get out of here. Don't know what that is, but I do not want to deal with it. What? 
Omba is definitely enjoying the mushroom forest. Okay, so we're just gonna take a step backwards for a moment. Omba ate the mushrooms. I thought he was gonna throw them, to be fair. But uh, he did not throw them, he indeed ate them. Which is uh, not healthy for my ability to deal with these things. Well, I want him to get off and not eat the mushroom again. But instead, he's going to eat them again. Wait, maybe the yellow one counters the effect? No, it just makes everything sad. Oh my lord. Oh my lord. Oh yeah, it's the mushroom forest, alright. If only Tomba could learn to not put everything in his mouth. See, he doesn't eat those, to be fair. So they regrow pretty fast. Is that a, a, a ghost? Ghost of a squash? chests that I want to open that I cannot can I jump on I cannot jump on those weird mushroom flower things this truly is a strange place okay we will use precise platforming except when we can't Don't know if there's a cure for mushroom mitis. Oh my lord. Well, I got a healing mushroom, but that's not helping me in my current drug fueled predicament. Oh my lord. So, Tombo commits suicide after eating too many mushrooms. In this case, too many being literally a single mushroom. Okay. This time, we will maybe not interact with the mushrooms. I wish I could see if the pit was down there. Or I do not wish to fall down a pit again. Okay. Oh my lord, I did not mean to jump on that. Okay. Well. This is a lovely forest. Lovely mushroom forest. Okay, this time. We will hopefully be a bit more cautious. Also, I really don't understand these ghost squashes. 
no idea what else to call them than ghost squashes. Ghost squashes either. So I'm just going to assume that's what they are. Oh my lord. Well, we're getting across, kind of, technically, maybe. Oh, dear lord. I'm beginning to wonder if this is not where I'm supposed to be. Let me view a healing mushroom. A mushroom that cures laughing or crying fits. Okay, well. That is definitely helpful. But I only have two of them. And there are significantly more than two mushrooms in this forest. Thus, I will attempt to not need to use them. When at all possible. Oh my lord. To be fair, I can't exactly see where the pits are. Other than falling. Okay. I guess we are going to try to head up. At least over here, we're gonna head up. going to immediately use a mushroom. Really? Really. Okay. Get down here. Son of a bitch. The healing mushroom also did not regrow. Okay. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. I wish there was a way to, like, look down with the camera. As far as I'm aware, there's not. Okay. Fine, this time, this time we've got it. Just gonna avoid all of these nerds. Oh man, I would love to see GDQ do this game. Well, to be fair, I'd love to see GDQ do any game. Oh my lord. The moral of this game is don't do mushrooms. No good comes of it. Unless you're an Italian, a, an Italian plumber, then you can do mushrooms all you want. Interesting. Very interesting. But we survived the mushroom forest. Oh, it's this guy. 
Hi there, ha ha ha, we meet again. Did you want to ride on my boat? Okay, but I'm pretty busy, so I can only take you one way. Didn't even get a choice. Alrighty then. A familiar looking mansion. Secret ocean side mansion full of chests, only one of which I can ocean open. Very interesting. Is this the mansion? I'm assuming it's from the beginning of the game. Yep. Now the only problem is I can't go back inside it to explore the other areas. Well. We will worry about that later. Look at this nice happy area that doesn't have mushrooms in it. That's all that really matters right now. Oh. Down. Listen. Down. There we go. almost jumping into several things we're fine and we can and not long at all get back to uh, the dwarven forest area find some new places to go we still need to find a place to learn how to swim I know that much goodbye old man We're definitely not going back to that mushroom forest for a good long while. I've had more than enough of it for now. Sounds about right. And then the exact same thing. We will not travel on the ground in this slidey place whenever possible. Now here I know there's some place new we can go to. Gotta not touch the horribly poisonous water. Well, I didn't want to touch the water, I wanted to kill that thing before it woke up. Which kind of worked. The Broken Fountain. Just look at the beautiful figures. Makes my soul feel cleansed. Is that all you gotta say about it? It is said that when the charity fountain is revived and works once again, something will happen. Look 
ground past here is like a slide. The look was called the leaf slider. Sorry, but I can't let you go any further. A little dangerous. Crying won't get you anywhere. But I, w I want to take the leaf slider. Fine. I will instead go right. Come back to the leaf slider later. Have you heard that there's a mushroom in Mushroom Forest that can make you laugh or cry? Oh. I've heard alright. I've never seen it, but... The Mysterious Mushroom. Nope. I think I'm good on that one. At least for now. Long time ago, the 100-year-old man told me a strange story. It goes something like... Shake some powder on the red flower, turn it blue, when red and blue mix... Uh-oh, I can't remember the rest. Red plus blue equals... Not red or blue. Did you come here to see Charity Fountain? It'll bring you luck for sure. Well, maybe. There's a lot of dwarves here. Charity Fountain is in the middle of the square, but it doesn't work. I saw a monkey named Charles in the village of all beginnings. He was so hungry, he couldn't move. And then I gave him bananas, and he could move. This is Charity Square. Charity Square. So it is, Dwarf, so it is. Alright. Well, um, I think there's one dwarf I had to talk to. The area below the watchtower is built with wood and isn't very sturdy. If you hit the side of a platform hard enough, you might break it. Well, that's very good to know. However, I'm gonna climb this vine out of nowhere, thank you very much. I want that butterfly. Can I get the butterfly? Hi, I didn't think anyone would find me up here. I'm collecting leaf butterflies. There's a legend that the leaf butterflies have special powers. Excuse me. I need to tend to something for just a minute. I will be right back.
I am back. Give me one moment to actually sit down. Had a um Oh Our puppy is our dog is uh a bit ill, so I had to assist with that a little bit. Hopefully just ill. But um this took a little of my attention. So Yeah. I mean, I'm assuming slash hoping it's nothing major, but something I will keep an eye on. There's a legend that the leaf butterflies have special powers. A legend that I should click on the game so I can hit the button. If you gather a lot of them, something wonderful is supposed to happen. If you want to see what happens, let me gather the leaf butterflies in this cage here. Well, I have leaf butterflies. Let's see, it looks like we only have one leaf butterfly so far. Well, that's because Tomba ate the rest and is not taking them out. I definitely have leaf butterflies though. Oh, you already have a couple. Let's see, looks like we have six leaf butterflies so far. I guess we need more than six. Shucks, you found me already. You won't find me next time. Oh, that was the guy that was playing hide and seek. And now he's gone again. Okay, well. I need leaf butterflies. And... Find that guy. Onward we go. Where we go, I don't know. Where we are, I know not as well. Oh, here we are. Which unfortunately is close to the Mushroom Forest, which is not where I want to be, but I uh, am running out of locales to go to. So, I might need to go back to the Mushroom Forest. Not something that I want to do. Oh my lord, spider, please. back again. The mountain up ahead. Stormy mountain. Dangerous. Strong winds. I'm guarding this place by... Didn't mean to hit that twice. Gives him time to practice. What practice? Well, my dream is to become a famous actor. I want to be an actor that can make people laugh and cry. But it is really hard. I'm not sure how to express emotions. Guarding this place by order of the elder, but it's really boring. That's what he said. Well, anywho, he, he needs to laugh and cry. And until he does, I can't get by. Or something of the sort. And very unfortunately... Pretty sure I know, know what I need to do. It's right over here. That face, that expression, it's great. Hmm, I see now. This is really useful. Hmm, but there's still something missing. What kind of face should I make to express sadness? The world's greatest pout. 
imagine like literally not knowing how to cry or be sad. I don't think he he needs to know. But if he insists. Oh my lord, Tomba. He couldn't even move because he was too busy laughing. Then he died. The end. I sure remember when I had like 10 lives. Now that's a face that sings sorrow. Let's see if I can master that laughing face and the crying face you just made. Hmm. So I think I can do it with some practice. Thank you, you've led me on to something. Practice, practice, I'm going to be busy now. Oh, almost forgot, the elder just went towards the mountain. He wanted to see you about something, you should go right away. Couldn't have told me that before. Well, I really hope this mushroom wears off now that I've gone into a new area. Or oh, we're gonna have a bad time. A stormy pig bag. Did you feel that? You just felt the evil spirit inhabiting Phoenix Mountain. That's true, this mountain has been cast under an evil spell. If you ever feel something like that again, it means the place you're at is under a spell. For the evil pig bags in those places. The key to find the evil pig bags is to search the areas that have been cast under a spell. Well, that is great. I'm literally gonna have to go back, find a mushroom, and then somehow get out without touching other mushrooms. Don't do mushrooms, kids. Or you'll end up like Tomba. I can't even attack this stupid flower. Oh my lord. Okay, I've got it. I would like to... So I'm gonna have to eat it now. I just wanted to get out of here before I used it. It's clearly not going to work. is a fine way to cure something, so we're just going to leave after that. And not come back for a good long while. Fine. It cured. Death is one of the easiest ways to cure everything. Hold on. Is there anything over here? Just a door that I cannot open. Arrgh, I'm all wet. I told you. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Well, you just had to go to the jungle, now didn't you? Well, I heard that the giant bird that lives on this mountain can take you there. Phoenix, it's been a long time since he's been known as the Master of the Skies. Who are these little cowboys? Oh, ah, ah, chew. I can feel cold coming on already. Hey, wait for me. What's the rush? Wait. Trust me, you should get down from this mountain right away. Okay, little cowboy. But I need to go this way. I mean, presumably. It's either this way or back to the mushroom forest, and we both know which way I'm not going. Okay. 
This wind is making it really hard to jump on this pig. Oh my lord. I just want to get that. Oh wow. It's like practically impossible to jump over there. You son of a bitch. I just want that money. Wind is truly something. Lunchbox acquired. Perhaps for healing. Cover some vitality. Yeah, we're gonna use that. Well, that's the way to go, but what about the monkey fella? Oh my lord. Intensely strong wind. I can like so almost make it, but not quite. This place is terrible. The wind blew me up there and I got caught. I don't know what I would have done if you hadn't shown up. Oh jeez, my pants are torn. I can't go anywhere like this. What if someone sees me? It's too embarrassing. I had an extra pair of pants with me, but I lost them in the wind. You've got to find them for me. Okay, you just sit here in the horribly dangerous wind instead of doing literally anything else. And I'll find your pants somewhere. kind of busy right now. And what am I doing? Can't you tell? I'm digging a tunnel. I don't mean to brag, but no one can dig as well as I can. Famous digger. Oh, stop now. If you keep looking at me with such admiration, I'm going to blush. Anyway, when this tunnel is finished, I'll be digging another one around here somewhere. Stop by to say hello. You say so. Smile. Oh my lord, you have got to be kidding me. Well, well then. When the wind dies down, well, the wind has not died down. Oh my 
my lord. Even more, oh my lord. We got this. Well, we had that. But we got platforming without being able to see where any of the platforms are. So, basically, we're good. Whoa! Well, I wasn't expecting a flying turtle shell to just come careening out of nowhere. Well, okay then. So that happened. This might take... Just a bit of finagling. Is this... I can't remember if this is before or after I rescued the monkey. Well, I will definitely try to be a pro platformer. We do not have the uh, the monkey quest. Now the question is, where the damn hell was the monkey? He's over this way still. To be fair, I would normally consider myself a pro platformer, but usually, again, you can see the platforms, you're platforming too. Yes, monkey, monkey, monkey. I get it. I get it, Charles. This is definitely one of those games that did not need a live system, but it has a live system because that's what you did in games. Yes, sir. I will... Get these quests, probably die again, and then have to get them again. It'll be great. Though I wish I had a sign that I could save at. That'd be better, ideally. Oh, I got past that plant. Not that that really seems to help. Oh boy, healing herbs. Oh, there's a crocodile under that. Excuse me, sir. I'm gonna have to go under the... in the plant. Crocodile. This isn't Donkey Kong. Get out of here. Go back to King K. Rule. 
Oh dear. No plants, please. might take a hot minute to get through this section, but it will be done. There ain't a platformer that has ever beaten me. to a segment where I can't proceed because I don't have items or something something dumb like that. But we should be good. This is definitely one of those games that I want to see a speedrun of after I'm done. I don't know if I really need all of these points. I mean, I definitely will do the quest at some point. points for anything else. Oh, I thought I almost got up there. would like to get up there, but I don't think I can. At least not as yet. I can only imagine, a lot of games have insane speedruns, but this, especially with the platforming being what it is, Wait, what happened? You know, that's fine. And I'll tell you why that's fine. That's fine. Because now we're going to save. I didn't even notice that I guess I went to a different plant. But that's fine, because now we save. I don't have to talk to the monkey and co again. No. Oh. But there's a platform I could jump on. Wasn't wasn't indeed a platform. monkey's pants blew away too. Yeah, we're at the dreaded section again. But it looks like there's something down here. Well, kinda. I just was off by a little bit. I don't want to go to that door. Pigs. 
Oh, I'm sure there's plenty of frustrating platforms. Platformers. Um... Ah. Right, those, those physics-based games. Physics in giant quotation marks. Well, now that you've mentioned it, I will have to at least try it. Someday. Someday when I really, really hate myself. Oh my lord. Well, okay. Fine. We'll get there this time. And then I'll find out that there's nothing in there but like a mushroom. It'll be great. Great for the whole family. I'll definitely add that to the list. The endless and ever-growing list of things that I need to stream. An endless list because more games keep coming out. Not to mention all the games that are and have been out that I haven't played. that window, huh? I'm gonna try, I think, one more time for that bottom platform. Then if that doesn't work, I'm just gonna go across. I'm pretty sure it's what I'm supposed to do. But I can't just see a door and not try to get it. That's not how gaming works. large keyhole. You don't say. sure was that. Now, hopefully with a million percent more success at actually getting across the chasm of death. All this for a bracelet. There's a grand quest to recover his grandfather's bracelet. jumps and then hopefully we're done with wind platforming over hell. Okay, there we go. Like a pro. I'm gonna assume I'm not supposed to go that way, so I'm not even gonna try. Said I'm gonna climb this ladder. You wanna meet the Phoenix? Are you trying to get to the jungle? Hmm, forget it. I've heard stories of the Phoenix taking people to the jungle too, but that was when he was young and healthy. Now, because of the storms here, he's weak and can't even find anything to eat. Who knows where he'll end up? 
Oh, well, that's not gonna stop Tomba. And then we fall somewhere. The mouse pig bag. What? You scared me. All of a sudden, you just fell from the sky. Who are you, creatures? You can't leave. The forest is too dangerous. There are monsters called the Bansugi in the mushroom forest. Bacchus Village. You know, that's fine. Because we can save. Wherever we are. The land of weird creatures, but also good town music. Stop staring at me like that. We may look like this now, but we're human just like you. Press X to doubt. You saw me, didn't you? That's weird. You're not scared by me? As soon as you can see, I look exactly like a mouse. Most people scream and run when they see us. Of course, we're not really mice. The evil pigs cast a spell on our village and turned everyone into mice. But we keep big hats on so that we will not scare others. Hey, you're traveling, aren't you? I have a favor to ask of you. I'm a collector of swords. I collect all kinds of things, but I can't seem to find any cheese. If you ever see any cheese during your travels, can you bring it back to me? I promise to give you something you'll like in return. Let's say when you collect ten slices of cheese, you can come back and see me. I'll be waiting right here. Well, I must say that it must be the most valuable item in the game, given how valuable cheese is. You come from Phoenix Mountain? That place has changed a lot since it was cast under a spell by the evil pigs. The House of the Red Fortune Teller. Special offer of free readings. But there is no fortune teller. Ooh wee! I touch a small body, I start to feel dizzy real quick. Squeak, squeak, squeak! You saw me, didn't you? I want to talk to that guy. Damn you, standing just so slightly inconveniently. This road leads to Bacchus Lake, but it's very, very dangerous. Don't go unless you really, really need to. Um, well, will you stop me is the question. Yes, you are stopping there. Well, we have made progress, and now we are going somewhere entirely new. I did not mean to walk back right in there. I wanted to see if I could climb the wall. And the answer was no, I could not. I can't always tell what walls I can and cannot climb. Regardless. Oh. Well, that explains where we are. And that helps me literally not at all. So... Based on that... I'm going to say we actually should be. I don't have a lot of options. So unfortunately, there is one door I know I can go through. I just need to get something from the forest right over here.
it's not the right one. Now we're going to find the door. And it'll be fine. This, I get it, Tomba. Oh my lord, stop. Just stop, stop moving. Stop. That, that is a weird sentence. But it's fine. Okay. I'm just going to... Get up here. And we will safely get to the door with no issues. No issues at all. Oh my lord, I thought you'd never find me here. I'll have to make the next spot even harder to find. Th that that was what was in there. That was all that was in there. Great. Wonderful. 10 out of 10. We're going to take a shortcut back. Then we're going to save so we don't have to do that again. And we are going to be confused as to where to go next because that leaves us with um, not a lot of places to go from my memory. Okay. To be fair, on his part, that was a good hiding spot. Because no sane person would think or want to check behind that door. But he's dealing with me. So he cannot hide. much as I hate to admit it, there might be more for me to do in this damn forest of mushrooms. If I can figure out where to go. Like, there's definitely something in the background, but I can't get... Oh, I can't. There we go. No trespassing. Danger. There are monsters living in this forest. Do not enter. Bacchus Village Nature Management. Are the monsters this jellyfish? I would sooner say the monsters are the mushrooms. Cannot seemingly enter the door. It's fine. I'm cured of horrible mushroom disease. It's all that really matters. Well, 
Well, actually, I want to go back there. I just want to not die to jellyfish. Which should be a lot simpler now, that I'm not stopping every one second. I definitely can't go in there, right? Not that I can tell. Ordinary mushroom acquired. That is like a, a mash X to doubt right there. But at least that's a quick way across so I can safely explore whatever else I missed over here. Hello, sir. can't seemingly open the door, but it appears there is nothing else to explore over here. At least, unless I find a way to open the door. So obviously, I will need to come back once I figure out how to open those chests. Shroom. Right, the phoenix burb? Does the phoenix want the mushroom? Oh my lord. I literally just came back from that hellscape. But I guess I need to go back again. Well, it's hungry. But... After dealing with the mushrooms, I wouldn't feed the evil pigs the mushrooms. The mushrooms are evil. It's very understandable. Check my events real fast. Make sure. Um, I don't think I can do anything here. Get through the haunted mansion to Bacchus Lake. What haunted mansion? Um, get the Phoenix, Stormy Mountain. Steal the powers of the evil pig in the bag. We light the lantern. Wow, put red and blue together for something I've never seen before. Do I have to go back to that one dwarf with the mushroom? Oh, jeez. I think I got healing herbs. So I can actually heal the dog. Then I need more leaf butterflies. Okay, so the quest log is only very, very marginally helpful, but it at least reminds me about some things I can do.
So we will do the healing herbs to the nurse at the dwarf village. I think that is the most immediate thing I can make progress with. We're going to save though. Also, I like have the pig bag for this forest. In theory, I could fight the evil pig of this forest, but I don't know where he is. I'm pretty sure I can't just use it. Can't use this here. There's one butterfly. Is I don't know. What are those two dots sourced to mean? Nope. Oh. Dorf village it is. For now. Healing herbs. Yes, I've got healing herbs. So I must use them. Healing herbs? You went to Phoenix Mountain and found them? It's a miracle you're still alive. Oh yes it is. Well these are Baron's wounds should heal now. Now all he needs is some good food and rest. Speaking of good food, there's nothing that can beat the taste of the fruit from the tree of knowledge. I wish I could have some of that fruit again. Are you, by chance, a snake? It's curious. Um, well, I think that is all I can do here. I don't think I have any other important key items that can Make progress. Uh, dirty mirror. But, like, I don't even know whose it is, so... Uh... A bucket that doesn't leak. Great for carrying liquids. those could possibly belong to. I don't think it's any of these. He lost something. But I don't know. Did he lose a bucket? Did you lose a mirror? No. Oh yeah, let me uh Cures laughing or crying fits and never runs out. Now that is a good mushroom. Well, that explains what the mushroom does. That is that is not going to a phoenix. That is staying in my backpack forever. Forever. This is clearly the most valuable mushroom in all of the land. Possibly the most valuable item in all of the land. It is a pig background for this is a very pig game. Technically, it's a wallpaper. Uh, 
um, of the game. I can try to use the mirror there. I have no idea where I would use this, but I guess it's not there. Get out of here, spider. Set down, so I jumped on his feet. Very lethal spider feet. Fine. Oh my god. Fine. Don't remember if there's anything important up there. No. The answer is a definitive no. that facing the right way again. I'm going to assume that I still can't do anything over here. I don't... Yeah, this is just a chest. Should not be anything up there. Means... Probably... I don't know. I indeed not... I indeed know not. This map is not helpful, but it's the only potential lead I have. Mushroom Forest. Mushroom Forest. better, but I'm going to assume I still have to be in the flower forest slash dwarf area, because everywhere else seems to be a dead end at this point. could climb the rope like a normal person, but Tamba is instead climbing the rock, and thank you very much for the follow. I really appreciate it. Now I need to not be lost. I can uh, definitely be worth following, but I have no idea where to go. <laughs> Oh my lord. I 
I really hope I have nothing else to do in the mushroom forest. But I would not have an idea of what to do. I do indeed still have to be there. So we... Yes, are going to try going over here again. We might as well save while we're at the signpost. anything I can do up there. I mean, presumably, the evil, the evil pig of this forest can't be too far away. These are the statues, which... I don't think I have anything for the statues. I guess I could collect more leaf butterflies, unless I have enough. There's that one dwarf who really wanted them. Question is, seven enough? And the answer is about to be found out. No. How many damn butterflies do you want, sir? The area below the watchtower. Where is the watchtower? I mean, look at this 3D map. So I can travel easier on this 2D plane of existence. Clearly. Okay, I think I know where the watchtower is. He's saying... No, that wasn't you. I don't want to talk to you. The area below the watchtower is built with wood and isn't very sturdy. If you hit the side of a platform hard enough, you might break it. Okay, well. Perhaps we can break a platform. These are platforms. Oh, I see. What is this? That is wood, Tombo. I know it's a very mysterious thing wood, but I guess I have to hit these spots. Nope. Hit it, now what? I wonder. I catch that water? Yes, question mark? Uh, I don't even know where Haunted Mansion is. I, uh, have not played this game before, so a lot of it is very mysterious to me. Okay, well, I have water. What that means, I don't know. But it's a third full.
Well, there's more water. Oh, jeez. I will do that. Now I've got a bucket of water, though. How that will help me, I know not. Oh, son of a bitch. Okay. Combo. Combo. like I can do anything more with that wood anyway, so. Oh yeah, the spiders are definitely annoying, but I think just by nature of how it's afflicted me, the mushroom forest is without a doubt my least favorite place in existence. Okay, and now that brings us to the horrible mushroom forest, which we're... <laughs> yeah, I only started this yesterday, and uh, I like it because it's a weird, but it also is very vague in a lot of ways. Um, well, I don't think... That. I don't even know if Haunted Mansion is on my map. I know... Someone in Bacchus Village mentioned it. But I don't think they would let me pass. Definitely challenging, although... Admittedly, I'm not a fan of the, the platform in the wind section. Yeah, this relates to Bacchus Lake, but it's very, very dangerous. Don't go unless you really, really need to. Well, I really, really need to, sir. Do you want a bucket of water? Do you want... anything that I own? You know, somehow I didn't even notice that I could go into the center of town. Amazing how I missed that. This is the Central Park, and that's the Town Hall. He's where? Oh dear, what are we going to do? Who? Who's where? Announcements for the village are posted on this bulletin board, so check it every now and then. Missing mouse. We have a missing mouse to report. A real baby mouse is missing. This is a real baby mouse and not a former human like yourselves. It must be found immediately. Anyone with information on the whereabouts of the baby mouse should notify the town hall. We'll come and pick it up. Thank you for your cooperation. Bacchus Village Town Hall. Well, that... I, I mean, it is my own fault that I missed it, to be fair. Oh man, I love that emote, I must say. <laughs> Swole Tomba. This road leads to Bacchus Lake, but it's very, very dangerous. Don't go unless you really, really need to. I read the sign though. Oh, maybe I have to talk to the mayor. I will find your mouse. Oh wait, that's not the mayor. 
Where is the mayor? This piece of paper I taped to the sign. We'll be back soon. So the red fortune teller. Yeah. Amazing how many little, like, quest notifications that I missed. I definitely do like quirky little games like this. Sure. Yeah. That appears to be all I can do in there. I didn't even know there was a community. Like, I... The only two places I heard of this game ever were, like, 20 years ago from a demo disc. What game the demo disc was on, I don't know. And then... I'm Andy here. <laughs> that is cool. Maybe since a whole bunch of old games are getting remastered and ported, this one will someday. What's wrong with this guy? All he's been doing is drinking milk. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Found the lost baby mouse. Ah, uh, it must have been Spyro 1 then. The wine from our lake is absolutely the best. Wait, your lake is made out of wine? Wait, I found the baby mouse. Uh, I don't think I've heard of Cooler World. Uh... Oh, I, I did find the lost baby mouse. Oh, I thought I would have to, like, bring it to Town Hall. But, if all the other people are humans that were turned into mo mice, why is the normal mouse also in clothes? Oh my, I didn't even dream he'd be in such a place. I see, we'll go right there and pick him up immediately. If you'd like, check out the bulletin board again. A ball that looked like a puzzle game. I might have seen it. I didn't have much in the way of PlayStation games in ye olden days. Adventurer wanted. The pump at the lake is broken and there's not enough wine for the village. If you didn't experience Adventurer, go to Bacchus Lake and fix the pump. Looking for courageous challengers who are not afraid of a haunted mansion. Bacchus Village Town Hall. Well, that sounds good. Like, as an example for how little I owned of Sony products, I didn't even know Final Fantasy existed until my friend played Final Fantasy X on a PlayStation 2, which I did not own. And I know there were like three Final Fantasy games for PlayStation. Gotomba? Well, if you're going to fix the Lake's Pump, I'll show you the way. I owned like Crash Bandicoot, Medieval, both of them. The Twisted Metal games, the weird PlayStation Star Wars games, the Haunted Pig Bag. And then some other, like, random stuff on the PlayStation. I know, and I was so surprised and happy when that got a remaster. I love that game. I am really hoping they remaster the second one as well.
this is an interesting little place. Hey, hey, not that way. Okay, sir. Excuse me, mouse. Oh my lord, I just want to explore, sir. Why are you doing this to me? You know, for as popular as they are, and as extraordinarily old as they are, I'm surprised Twisted Metal hasn't been remade by this point. I love those games, but honestly, trying to replay the original PlayStation Twisted Metals, uh, they do not look good. Maybe my eyes are too used to modern graphics, but sometimes it's hard to... It, last time I tried to play the PlayStation versions, oh my lord. I hate this door. I despise this door with all fiber of my being. There was a game like Twisted Metal that I loved. That definitely looked a lot better, in my opinion. That also should be remade with Twisted Metal, and that was called Vigilante 8. And that was a fun car destruction game. I think I might have played that more than Twisted Metal, just because I liked a lot of the cars and characters more. Phew, we're finally here. I tried to fix it, but I'm just not strong enough. Well, Tomba is like a literal caveman, so I don't know how he's going to fix the pump. There's a hole that looks like something is supposed to be placed in it. I mean, there's a lot of things that can go in holes. Gonna, gonna have to be more specific there. Oh, well, at least what I needed was right there. Just like Resident Evil, find a, a wheel and put it in the pipe, or in the hole. It's also something I own, like all of them on PlayStation. Amazing games. Uh, so it's on, right? I just turned it on. I think it's on the pump we heard, yep. There you go. Looks like that did the trick, let's head back. I want to explore the mansion. Why must I carry you on my back? I must explore the mansion. Listen, off-brand Kazooie, I want to explore. That's it. I'm gonna bring him back home and then I'm coming right back. Oh man, I hope he also got bit from that. Well, thanks again, don't forget to report this to the town hall. And Tomba listens, despite the fact that I'm clearly in charge of the situation. Hello, Town Hall. Look, wine! There's wine again! You've been a tremendous help. I'm not sure how we can thank you. Oh, I know, there's always plenty of wine here. Feel free to take as much as you want anytime. Oh, but not for you, okay? A drink for grown-ups. What is Tomba, like 12? Uh... 
That is a good question. I have one. Uh, I there was a big loss of life to the the evil horror of the mushroom forest and also the platforming in the wind section. Those two things combined basically wiped out ten lives. Dear Tomba, if you ever have any problems in Vegas Mountain or anywhere else, please feel free to contact the nearest mouse. We will help you in any way we can. Good luck in your travels. Sincerely, residents of Bacchus Village. P.S. Please note that we may not always be able to solve your problem. Hello, controller. Yeah. I mentioned before, but like I feel this game just has lives because other games had lives. But it doesn't really need to. I mean, I think most games don't need lives, but to be fair, in modern times, or recent days, a lot of games have gotten rid of lives as a system. Like, Mario Odyssey doesn't have lives. Crash Bandicoot 4, by default, doesn't have lives turned on. Excellent. Well, now I can explore the haunted mansion. I don't know if I was supposed to take wine from those guys. I mean, I did get a quest about it, but I'll worry about that when I come back. But now I'm gonna eat some birds. Large key panel one acquired. Ooh, okay. And still more chests I cannot open. With the way the 3D camera is and just the weird structure of this mansion, it makes me think of a level from Captain Toad. Excellent. They're also more of a more of a cave than a mansion. Where am I now? North side of mansion. I am going to play Tomba 2 after I finish this one. Another chest I cannot open. Excellent. I feel that I shouldn't jump down there, but I'm very tempted to do so. Hey, what do you think this is? It's a real unusual painting. It kind of looks like there's an indentation here. I wonder if you're supposed to insert something. Come to think of it, there's a door with a large keyhole somewhere in this building. I wonder if this has anything to do with that. Oh, interesting. Then I will definitely uh, keep that in mind. I do usually 100% games when I play through them. Well, I mean, I always eventually do, but whether I do it on my first playthrough depends on if there's more difficulties, but I don't believe there are in this case. I most certainly will be 100%ing both of them. A 
a small keyhole. but it happens. Interesting. Oh. Even more reason for someone someday do a remake of this game, I suppose. I don't even know who, who would own the IP of this. I don't even remember the company name that made this game. Or if anyone owns the IP, technically. Okay. My curiosity is definitely going to get me killed, but I must, I must investigate. It's giving me the option to go here, so I'm gonna see if I can go here. Aha! Nothing. Which is technically better than death, but... That's fair. Guess it depends on who owns the IP, if anyone does, or if the IP was just lost to time. Um, hello, sir? Is this why I have the Jewel of Fire? Jewel with the power of fire, maybe I should equip this. Maybe I can walk through fire. Uh... Oh, interesting. I shall break all the eggs then. Does this do anything? Let's see, there's a charge meter for it though. Okay. Now that old old man is very calm, despite being literally surrounded by fire. Get that egg over there. I don't know if the game is going to tell me when I've got all the eggs, but I feel like I might have gotten all of them. No, there's that one. They must have respawned, because I definitely got that before, I think. I will, uh... Interesting. That fixes that camera, but I don't think, yeah. Oh, we are definitely going to find out. I 
really hope it's not in one of these stupid face rooms. Or else I'm gonna have to take a very sad trip back to the mushroom forest. And then probably I'm gonna have to take a very sad trip back to the mushroom forest. Large key panel three. Well, that is a very big relief that it is not, in fact, in the evil mushroom land. I don't even know how I missed these rooms, but it is somewhat disorienting. orienting to maneuver around the mansion given how it's designed. I have fallen so many times in this game for one reason or another. Well there's the large keyhole. Yeah I just need to find a sign. No, Tombo, go down. Down is the direction that we go. There's another ye old door. It looks like it. Yeah, I do fall sometimes. But just you wait. One day I will stream. I will stream the Donkey Kong Country games, and then you will see what pro platforming looks like. It's definitely not being exhibited in this game, but I also do still have to stream Crash Bandicoot Four. To be fair, because I've never finished that. Donkey Kong Country and Crash Bandicoot are my two favorite platforming series. As much as I love Mario, I love the feel of the Donkey Kong games more. Owie. Okay. We're going to find that sign. Then I'm going to save. I grew up with it. I still play all the Donkey Kong games once a year, just about. Well, all the country games. I've technically never played Jungle Beat, but... I mean, that's not really a Donkey Kong country game. But Country 1, 2, 3, Returns, and Tropical Freeds are all really great games. Well, I'm exceptionally thankful that Nintendo has finally announced Pikmin 4 after 8,000 years. I really want them to do another Donkey Kong. Yeah, I cannot swim. But we're not going to try to go over there. Tomba is very allergic to water. I cannot open that chest yet. Soon. Oh, we are technically at the four hour mark. 
And I do need to eat food before I'm hungry, but I'm going to go a bit longer because I must solve the mystery of this mansion. We're probably after this mansion segment. will be the end of stream for today. So, two more key parts, though I'm assuming I need to learn how to swim to get at least one more of them. Presumably I might need to learn how to swim to find the other egg, I'm not entirely sure. The real question is, can I remember what doors I have and haven't been in? The answer is almost certainly no, by the way, but I can still pretend to try. Eventually we'll find the right one, probably. Yeah, I was already down there. There was water down there, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. Yet another chest I cannot open. For shame. No, it was definitely not there. Makes me wonder. Um. Yeah. I will find that old man. Though I don't think I've gotten the last egg. is true. I just need to find the right angle and remember where it was. Was it here? No. I will have to try that. Unfortunately, Tomo cannot slide. Oh, wait, down. Oh, that is definitely very helpful. That takes me to here. I know the one on the right is the elevator. I think this was just a key. Oh, it's this mysterious door that I don't know what to do with. Angrily pound it for good measure. And then the key door, which I cannot currently access. This is the elevator. Is just posing menacingly as he rides. And also telepathically controlling a boomerang. That's the whole other story. Yes, okay. So I will go around the right side again. I think.
surely it was one of these. He was just asking for it. But... These are all... Well, I haven't been in here, even though this is not where I wanted to go. Good thing you were around. I work at the town hall. I went to the lake to fix the pump myself. Right, well, just look at me. I came all this way. I even brought the key to the small room. It's really pathetic. I know. I'm going to go back to the village for a while. If there's something you need, don't hesitate to come see me. I'll be at the town hall. You be careful now. Well, uh, we can access one door. Let me just definitely get to a save point again. Hold on. Yeah, I'll get to a save point before I check out that door. I just gotta remember where the small key door was. I think it was on the top by the chimney. It feels like there's so much more of this game still left to go. I'm still missing like three different kinds of keys for chests, and I haven't even caught a single evil pig. Oh dear, leave me alone. What I want to do, I need to get on the other side. It's necessarily a bad thing. I just, uh, I guess I was not expecting it to be this long. Or long. I mean, it's not been long so far, but th there's definitely a lot more to it than I thought. Probably a better way to phrase what I meant. Um. I need to go around. Okay, that is it up there. I'm almost positive. Now, well, that's yet another egg destroyed. Now, with our nice one health and no healing items, we're somehow going to find the old man. Somehow. We're gonna do it, definitely, without issue. Don't think it was up here, but maybe this took me close to where I needed to go. No. This room is too bright. I'll definitely know it when I see it. The problem is, I don't entirely remember. Exactly where it was. However, I am going to save again, because why not? You know, it makes no sense 
because the game is in no way related to this one, but... Oh, well that's very convenient, actually. But, what makes no sense is the game is not at all related to this. Oh, you know, that's a good idea, Roxy, about the Firestone. I'm definitely gonna have to check that out. I keep getting distracted when I talk. What I'm trying to say is, this game is making me nostalgic for another game. Even though it makes no sense, because this game is in no way similar to that other game. But I guess it's just the whole old PlayStation vibe. But... On that note, for some reason, this game weirdly makes me nostalgic for a game I only got to play the first one of, and I only got to play once, called Ape Escape. So, look forward to that in the distant future. Because now that this game has weirdly and inadvertently reminded me of that game, I will be playing that at some point. Ape Escape. He said, there's no reason this game should remind me of it, but it's just that old PlayStation vibe. And I know that was a fun game as well. PlayStation had a lot of, like, cool, like, one-off games that didn't get quite as popular as Nintendo franchises, but... are definitely still fun. Yeah, I'm not surprised, Dan. <laughs> A lot of things on PlayStation, just, while good, never really got a lot of uh, traction. I mean, there's a lot that did, obviously, like Metal Gear Solid and... Whatever else PlayStation 1 had, Crash Bandicoot. Okay, well now I'll be at full health, so that's fine. Oh my lord. Why does it hover over new game? I do not want new game, I want load. Okay, now I'm assuming slash hoping that the eggs are still destroyed. They appear to be. Now I can continue my relatively futile quest to find the old man. Because I swear I'm checking everywhere but the spot that he is. In there. Pretty sure he's not in here. Okay, I I will use my deductive powers. I don't think there's anything to do up here. Okay. And no, it's not that door. Oh. It was that door, wasn't it? I forgot there was a door. Ah, you're back. The 100-year-old wise man had good things to say about you. Looks like he was right, too. So you want to hear more about the evil pigs, right? The evil pigs use very powerful magic that can warp an entire area under their control. However, they need an enormous amount of gold to produce this kind of magic. They must be gathering all this gold in one place somewhere. If you find this place, I'm sure you'll find your grandfather's bracelet. The 1,000-year-old man? Here's a present for you. It's the 1,000-year-old key. 
this key will open all of the 1,000 year old treasure chests. You'll find what you need to get behind Phoenix Mountain in a 1,000 year old treasure chest. I think I left it at Phoenix Mountain, but remember, there's a special technique in getting through the lava caves. Flames from the lava inside the caves will also be a problem. I'm afraid there's nothing you can do until you find the evil pig that cast a spell and steal him away. The green evil pig bag will reveal the evil pig gate, so search the lava caves for the bag. I can see it in your eyes. You'll become stronger. Just don't lose your courage. First, you should climb the stand of the sun torch somewhere near this building. It'll show you a new power. After that, you must use your own strength to find your way. That sure was a lot of things you said. Take care of yourself. You'll meet some friends of mine up ahead. They can help you. Be careful of the ten... Be careful of the 10,000 year old man. He's not a bad man, but well, you'll find out. Good luck. So, this clearly means that there's a, that somewhere there's a 100,000 year old man, a 100,000 year old key, and a 100,000 year old chest. And fuck you, you stupid plant thing. Oh, what a uh, hot spring question mark? So Tom just had to enjoy the hot spring a little. Well, I've got to enjoy it more because I'm not leaving with four health when this is right here. Oh, well, I know there's a 1,000 year old chest in one of these rooms, because I kept running into it, and kept being unable to open it. In fact, I'm relatively sure I know where it is. Then I gotta climb whatever the hell he told me to climb, the sun shaft. The sun tower. But I'll probably find that chest, then save, and that'll be it until tomorrow. Or it is getting, it is food time. And it's also, what, like 11-ish p.m.? Yes. Thankfully I don't work tomorrow. But... Still, I, I can't go ruining my sleep schedule too horribly. But I, but I just got the key. Did I not? Hmm. I got the firepower before I got the key to open the chest. Ha! Ah. I'm gonna say that looked suspiciously like hey. I definitely made it too easy this time. See ya. And thank you for stopping by, Andy. I will catch you next time. You have a good rest of your night, sir. Wow, two cheeses. There was another blue chest somewhere. The 1,000 year old chest. That's all I've got to find now. That is not it. Later, Andy, my man. And that's the key. I mean, there's only one more of those, but I'm sure I need to learn how to swim to get that.
Unless there wasn't another blue chest, but I swear there was. Because that one, that's the room I was thinking of, but that chest is a red chest, not a blue chest. So I could be entirely mistaken, and there is not a blue chest, in fact. Oh my lord. Gotta change the damn camera so I can see. I... Well... Well... At least now I know where the last key is, but that mushroom hell torture is definitely going to wait till tomorrow, unfortunately. God, do I hate those mushrooms. At least I have the unlimited mushroom cure now. That is beneficial. But... I still am definitely liking this game. I'm definitely going to 100% this and 100% Tomba 2, and then continue streaming weird games, because this, this game puts me in the mood for weird games. So tomorrow, I will resume the stream probably around 6 or 7 Central Standard Time, because um, that's about when I'll usually be able to stream after work, when I do work anyway. And we will continue with more Final Fantasy 2 and then Tomba. For now, I want to thank each and every one of you for stopping by. Thank you for the new follow. And I hope you all have an absolutely wonderful rest of your night. Until then, and as always, I will see you next time. Thanks very much, friends. <laughs>